Betty, hi, it's Lynn. This merch letter, I have a dear Mr. V-O-M-I-T-Z. Can that be right? Poor guy. Yeah. Bye. inquiries. Rita had a fit. So what else is new? What I wouldn't do to get out of here. This office. This city. Where would we go? I don't know. You choose. I chose last time. Right. How about Paris? Paris is supposed to be nice. We don't speak French. We'd manage. So what do you think about hitting Marty's tonight after work? Ladies' night. Don't need to scope for guys to buy us our drinks. <sighs> Can't. Narita asked for someone to stay and help with sales proposals. And you said yes? Oh, Nancy, it's time and a half. You know, one of these days you're going to push Narita too far, and I'm going to be paying the rent all by myself. Fine, I'll go to the gym. We were going to go tomorrow night. So I'll go tonight, too. And then you're going to come back for me. Nancy, I'll be fine. You take a taxi, at least? OK. OK. This bus man wants his coffee. Nancy! What? I could have done worse. No, man, no, I told you I didn't. I didn't shoot him. The truth, I got the truth, man. sure that's him? He only screamed in my face. 
What did he scream? He wanted to know what the first guy told me before he shot himself. And what did he tell you? I don't know. He tried to tell me something, right? But I had my headphones on, you know, my Walkman. So you didn't hear him? Not at all? Isn't it the custom to take your headphones off when someone's trying to tell you something? No, when you don't want to hear them. Look, I, I thought the guy was a pervert or something. I didn't know. You got your Walkman with you now? Talk to me, Burke. OK. Waters, I can't keep it in any longer. I love you. Always have. Well, not always, but ever since you got the toupee. I can't hear a damn thing. Where can we reach your folks? I can't. They're dead. Did you live with someone? A girlfriend, why? You might want to call her. You'll be with us a while. We'll be a couple of minutes. Stay put. Put the gun down. I'm calling the cops. I'm not kidding. I'm not either. I mean, come on, take a look. Go! Go! Here, try this. Is that yours? Yeah. Well, sorry, I got blood on it, so. Thank you. How did this happen? Get it back downstairs. Come on, back to business. So, Ted. Apparently, one of your boys didn't have his holster snapped, huh? And one didn't have his head screwed on right. Hey, come Excuse on. me, I took the guy down, didn't I? Yeah. We were all very entertained how you did it. Hey, if I'd gone by the book, the guy'd be out the door waving his gun in the street. You could have got somebody shot, Jack. Dad, I didn't, I did don't I? don't care. You're 124 for the week. You got it? Yeah, I got it. You're gonna live. Oh, sure. Just got myself a free nose job, is all. How you like it, miss? Get it looked at. The show is over, Miss Carlson. Right this way. You sure you're all right? Yeah. I'm tough. Yeah. The two men you met at the subway tonight happened to be the guards who lifted two million bucks off an armored car in downtown last week. I saw it on the news. So you know that a police officer was killed in the robbery. Well, the man who shot himself, John Reynolds, called us. He wanted us to know that he wasn't the one who committed the murder. He said it was his partner, Tommy Franco, the man who chased you. He hid the cash from Franco and agreed to take us to the hiding place if we agreed to grant him immunity in the murder. 
He was supposed to meet with us, but Franco caught up with him, as you well know. And since a desperate man might confess certain things, it's likely that he told you where the money is. But I didn't hear a thing. Now, we know that, but Franco doesn't. Wait, suppose I heard something. Doesn't he realize that I would tell you? Well, it might not mean anything to us, only to Franco. And that's why he'll be back. We'd like to put a policewoman in your apartment to act as bait. Well, then what do, what do I do? Disappear? Yeah, so to speak. We put you up, and we provide you with a rotation of officers to watch the place. What about work? Have you got any vacation time? You sure Lisa and Alice are okay with this? Yeah, they got a sleep sofa. Hey, don't go stealing Alice's boyfriend now. <laughs> Not a bad idea. You leave this cop chick instructions on how to water the plants? She'll be fine. What about you? 